All right, today we will be taking apart the center console. I'm trying to get to this part right here because uh, I just sold it. It's a 2012 Ford Explorer. I'm pretty much parting it out. So you couldn't really find any videos on how to take that specific part out. So I figured I'd just make one. It's really cold out here in Michigan. So plastic pieces might not bear with me. Coming. Those damn rivets. There we go. Alright. So what are these bolts right here? They look like they might be sevens or sixes. How's that? Six. It's probably a seven. Yep, it's a seven mil. There's... All right, comes apart like yay. This is one connector right there. Put that aside. Doesn't help that this car is pretty much dead. Again, this is a parts car, so. I can, I can be mean to it. Not too mean, but 10 mil. There's my 10 mil. It's 11. It's 10. Yep, it's right on the money. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen.
I could leave that right there for now. Okay. Another 10 mil bolt. Again, I'm just first time taking this stuff apart, so. Car's coming apart anyways. I'm just gonna start taking random stuff apart here. Just start kind of shimmying things off. Let's see. So that's a seven, seven mil. Okay. There we go. Now I'm not sure how this shifter comes apart. Does it need to come apart? Let's get it all the way in the reverse position. Be as gentle as possible here. I'm guessing if it's just like my Pontiac, that comes out. All right, so I was right about that. Still couldn't really find anything, so I'm just gonna start taking things apart based on the picture from their parts catalog this whole panel comes apart just held by together by rivets uh, connector for the climate control connector for the little cigarette lighter how does that come out there's one of those twists Side. So, I'm just taking things apart. Now, why doesn't this want to come out? Another bolt. I don't see anything holding it. There's three wires. I don't know if you guys can see where my finger is goes into a connector let's see no there we go
not sure exactly how that comes out. There's a wire for the USB, it looks like. Alright, so it's right here. Looks like there's a tab at the top. And a tab at the bottom. So you're going to separate the two tabs. Boom. Get your USB. And to whoever bought this part off of me, just know what I went through. All right. But yeah, in summary, to take this apart, we're just going to replace this, this piece right here. All you needed to do was uh, take these two pieces off, which were the side things. First, you pry these off, pry that side off. Then this stereo console will be right there like that. There's four seven millimeter screws or bolts that you need to take out. One, two, three, four. Take that out. Obviously, you're going to disconnect stuff. Um, then when you come to here, you don't need to take off these side panels. That's only if you're going to take this whole console out. So I'll leave these side panels on. What you're going to need to do is open up this right here and then you're going to pry off this plastic piece there's a plastic piece over there and you'll see you have there your little cigarette lighter so you're just going to pry that off like that just let it sit in there there's another seven millimeter bolt take that out pry this out when you pry this out there's going to be a whole bunch of connectors you're going to need to disconnect a whole bunch of connectors is this there's a uh, the back over here um, obviously this right here, uh, goes in something like that. So I believe it's the light for, uh, for this little center console storage bin area. You're going to disconnect all these wires so you can pull it up. And then when you pull it up, obviously your shifter is going to be stuck in place. I pried this out as shown in the video. So uh, that's going to be in there. You pry it out with a little plastic pry bar. And then you're going to, there's, you're going to come underneath it. So imagine this is right here. Come underneath it with a the screwdriver. There's two screws that's holding this piece to this rod. So you're going to take one, two, take that out. And then as you're pulling up, be careful. There's three wires. There's, there's three wires that goes into a connector. These three wires right here. It goes into this connector and it connects in in there so be careful don't pull it out too hard make sure you disconnect this first you're gonna move it around this plastic piece um then you should be able to slide it off and then you're gonna have these all these connectors you're gonna have the cigarette lighter one where's the cigarette lighter one this gray one right here cigarette lighter push tab comes out out of the gray one then you're gonna have this uh, connector with the with the red. You'll see this little red gizmo thing on it. You gotta pry that back, pry it back, and then push on the black tab. It comes out. And when it comes to the USB connector, what I did was so I couldn't really get in there and reach it. It's got um it's got a little rivet that's implanted into one of the plastic parts there. So I, I kind of yanked it, pulled it out, and it was in here. When it's in there, you got a plastic tab on the top and a plastic tab on the bottom. You separate those and it comes right out. So now that this is out, looks like I gotta take apart it. So I gotta take some, uh, looks like they're torque screws. One, two, uh, you should be able to figure that out. All right. And uh, good luck. Sorry that this video took long and a lot of unnecessary parts to it, but I hope it is helpful for anyone watching.